Hello, dear travelers. Today we will take you on a tour of the beautiful Ajiji in Guadalajara. We will show you around its narrow streets, cobblestone roads, go for a walk on the Malecon, enjoy the views of Lake Chapala, and more. And if you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe so you don't miss any of our future adventures. Do you like a hihik? Rosie, what about you? You're such a cute dog. Look at this beautiful place we have here for the next week. That's like a lobby place. And look, the best part of it is the outdoor. Look at all these beautiful plants. So that's how the roads here. Everything is a cobblestones. You have a lot of greens. You can hear birds around the uh, roosters. Basically, it's a small place with uh, just beautiful streets. And let's go check the lake. This is very interesting tree. There's trees going inside the trees. Oh yeah, and it's like the inside of it, like the the inside of the human body. So here you can see the inside of the tree. Wow. Wonder of nature. I just think this place is so unique and beautiful. The road here and just all the trees around, how cool they are. Wow, you look so much fit now. <laughs> really, look how cool it is here. You can just come and just work out outside. You can see there is a lot of expat population here. The signs here in English. Pick up after your animal. So here's the Malikon walk with a beautiful lake view. Across from that, you can find a picnic area where you have like beautiful area that you can just rest with the shade and trees. Yeah, whoever have a husky knows this dog has full of energy. You need to release it and look at him. What a cutie. What a beautiful Malecon. It's completely different feelings from uh, other Malecons we've been, that it's uh, by the ocean. It's much more quiet and peaceful here. More like a village style Malecon. Wow. You have here a pretty large park for kids with the uh, fake grass. So it's pretty uh, soft and comfy.
check prices for the real estate of Akiti. The prices are in pesos. Most of the streets here is one way because they're pretty narrow as you can see. Look at this beautiful wall. Each one of them has a name. Pretty much says anything that's alive is cool. One day will die. Everything, no matter how famous it is, no matter how strong, how weak, how popular. But if you want to help it to last longer, put it in art. So that's what these people did <laughs> to make it, their names last a little longer. And you're gonna live a lot longer than yourself. Yeah, you're gonna stay here in the wall and people like us are gonna come and see you. That's cool. amazing. Hello, Baba. Hello, Bobby. Hello, Randy. <laughs> one-way street and in all of the streets you have interesting shops and galleries a lot of restaurants you can find here the roads as you can see all over a hihi because the cobblestones but they're not really flat stones they're kind of poking out so you need to really wear comfortable shoes and be careful when you walk in here they do have a bike lanes here They have machine here that they're making the smaller pieces right here as you can see. Look how nice it is and it's all handmade. What is it like a wool? What type of see okay? This is so pretty. You can see the sidewalks are pretty narrow and the streets as well. We just came to the main street. You can see it's two-way street. You have more traffic here. Definitely on the main street, you have much more traffic. You can also find rental units here. We found some donut shop called Donuts Donuts. Let's go see what they have inside. You know I'm always down for some donuts. Each donut costs 30 pesos and they have a really large selection here. Look at all this chocolate. Let's see. Mm. Very nice dough. It's different from what I'm used to. It's not chewy. It's soft. Very soft. You like it? And a lot of chocolate. <laughs> Let's try this strawberry donut. It looks pretty big. Mm. This one is different than the chocolate one. This one feels very fluffy, the dough inside. And this one feels like regular donut. I'm not sure why. I love this one much more. Wow. Wow. Delicious. Fresh squeezed orange juice is always good, no matter what time of the day. It's 
especially after donuts. Vitamin C is always needed. You don't want to park in front of this gate right here. It says if you park here, they're going to flat your tires. Look at those cows on the lake. We have a fishing boat. It looks like some people live there. So Lake Chapala is the largest body of water in all of Mexico. It feeds water to many towns. And as you can see, there are many different towns all over the Chapala Lake. Even the next one we're going to be showing you next week, the town of Chapala. So make sure you stay tuned. Make, hit the like button and subscribe so you don't miss it. There is some pretty large homes right on the Lake Chapala view. We are so lucky to be in here in the springtime because you can see all those beautiful trees and flowers. Everything is blooming right now. One thing that we notice in this town is how clean it is. And we see a lot of trash bins like this one. It's like another one here in a hundred feet and it stays pretty clean. That's one nice thing about this town. Of course you do have some loose dogs because this is Mexico. They belong to somebody because they do have the collar. Yeah, so basically that's all the streets. Everywhere you turn, the streets are in the same style. One-way street, pretty narrow, with the cobblestones. And colorful homes. Definitely afternoon, the Malikon much busier than in the morning time. Good morning! Look at this beautiful morning in the Malikon. It's pretty cold in Ajijic compared to the other places in Mexico and they say that Ajijic has the best weather. We don't even have AC in our recommendation and it's just perfect. So on this lake, it's not recommended to swim in. It is contaminated, so it's not very healthy for you to swim on. But you still find some people fishing. Some fishing boats there. Look at this tree inside. Very unique stuff there here. And everything is like handmade. Look 
pretty. Everything is colorful. Look how beautiful. I love Ahihik. I love the artwork. Devir on the walls is just amazing. It's so pretty. You need to open your eyes and look everywhere because the magic is everywhere here. Look how cool is this tree. They respect the tree definitely. It was here before the building. The farther you go from the center and the lake, the more local it gets. Even the streets getting wider here. But it's pretty cool. There is a large spa here. If you want a massage here in Ahihi, it's 620 for an hour, 400 for half an hour. This is a cool plaza. A nice place to spend the afternoon. You have places to sit here, restaurants around the plaza. We are on the way to find the best burrito restaurant in Ajijic. Yes, and one thing about Ajijic, if you put something on the GPS, it's not going to take you there. It's going to take you around that area. And you just need to find it. <laughs> yes, so a lot of places in Mexico are like that with the Google for some reason. So around the area, close Ex enough. Explore a little bit more <laughs> before you get to the place. Yes. <laughs> All right, we found it. So it's in the cinema. You have your machines for kids to play. Movies the plane. It's a little food court. They do have a, they do have sushi here. Playground for kids. And. <laughs> And there's some burrito place. burgers so we're gonna try one of each the best sellers this burrito is huge it's just the, the size of it it's really really big look at that this one is the shareable size it's really big I've never seen burritos so big Wow, I think it's the best burger I ever eat. It's so juicy. They have inside vegetables, bacon. Look how big it is. You have your beautiful big homes. Look at this one. Like looks like a it's a newer build, more modern style. Wow, some homes are really huge here. It's a nice experience to walk around the streets here because you can see so much uh, beautiful plants around. Everything is very uh, kind of unique. And the homes are also beautiful. Here are some people gonna do kayaks. You can actually see people swimming in this area. I guess it's a local people. Mm -hmm. 
this house looks like it has its own soccer field there is here a, a rental places right in front of the lake the huge buildings for short and long term rentals with a pool and hot tubs Hihik Malikon we're going back another outdoor gym not sure if you can see from the sun but look the nest they build in those birds There is a holiday weekend here and um, all over you can see a lot of families. It's pretty packed. Cheers! Fresh! Woo. Fresh! Woo. <laughs> ha! I love it! One thing for sure that Mexicans know how to celebrate. Each holiday they like enjoying the most you can see them having drinks and dancing and music and with the family and it's just amazing to see this type of culture we enjoying it you need to catch up buddy look at me <laughs> we are reached to the end of this video thank you so much for staying here with us and exploring the town this town is very beautiful. There's a lot here to do, a lot of art, uh, clean streets, restaurants, I mean, you name it. A lot of expats here, so you're gonna feel like home. Everybody speaks English here, so it's kind of a, a pretty safe place, I would say. You, you walk here and you feel really great. Yes. We love it. Thank you so much. Uh, we love making this for you. Please don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe so you don't miss any of our future adventures. We appreciate you so much and we'll see you on the next one.